Back at A23, well, Halloween going to be here less than a week, and that means your kids will be at home with lots of candy. Of course, if you're like my family, you're going to have lots of piles of sweets just laying around. So what's the problem, right? No, just kidding. All right. Right now, doctors Jessica DeRue and John Lydiot are here from Lydiot and DeRue Dentistry telling us now about a program using those leftovers for a very sweet cause. Good morning to you both. Good morning. All right, let's start with you, uh, Jessica. Tell us about the buyback program, what this is all about. A program, this program is something we do in our office where we get the kids to bring in their candy after trick-or-treating, okay. and we take that and use it for good use and send it off. This year, we're we're sending it to Operation Gratitude, okay. um, which goes to the troops and families of troops and service members um, that they send it back to them. Are kids willing to give, to give up their candy? That's got to be the hard part, right? Well, we recommend picking out a few of their favorite pieces because, you know, you want to enjoy it a little bit. But we incentivize, okay. we incentivize them and offer them to buy it back for a dollar okay. a pound. Okay. And once the kid the, or the parents take their cut, right? That's true. Yeah. yeah. Okay. We so, always hide our secret stash. Yeah. <laughs> you do too, right. Okay. Um, how long have you been doing this? So we, we've probably been doing this program for about, you know, 10 to 15 years. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So, so a long we've time. Had, yeah, and we've given to different organizations over the years, so we bounce that around. And So it's a dollar a pound. How much money are we talking? Can you really uh, dish out to kids? I think the most we've given is about $5, about. Okay. So about five pounds. That's a lot of candy. That's a lot of candy. That's a lot of candy. Yeah. All right. So um, why why do this? Why, tell us what uh, what gave the incentive to get involved. Well, people are always looking for healthy ways, trying to stay healthy around the holidays. Okay. And this way they can still enjoy a little bit of it, but they're not getting all that sugar on their teeth as much as they would if they're constantly snacking on it. And it saves the parents money, too, because they don't have to go out and try to bribe their kids right. to give up their candy. They can just bring it to us, and then we can benefit other people. Now, I'm sure you're the cool dentist, right? You, <laughs> you don't give out, like, dental floss and toothbrushes right at Halloween? Come on. <laughs> he just laughs. Yeah, I do. He's like, okay. Uh, what candy should we avoid? Is there any specifically over Halloween? Well. Recommendations or? I mean, the hard candies that you that you put in your mouth or you suck on for long periods okay. of time, you know, that that's what gets those acid levels up okay. and, and can uh, create some breakdown okay. uh, of our enamel. So, you know, it's okay to have a little bit of candy here and there, you know, eat it. Get rid of it. They, see, these are the best. Just yeah, a plain see, chocolate. She knows. Okay, yeah. from the experts. Then go right. brush and floss. Yeah. What <laughs> other programs are you involved in? Because you do more so, than just this. Yeah, we do several uh, programs around our community. We, you know, our practice, we've always felt it's important to, to give back to our community. And, uh, you know, we have a scholarship program that we do for some high school kids uh, to help out with the college tuition. And nice. we do some... Uh, we do some a blue moon run, and we worked with uh, Coca Belly Kids. We do some runs for them, uh, other sponsorships. Uh, you know the Avarian Run Walk. Okay. There, you know there's several things, as well as you know we like to help out with the kids' uh, sports teams and the schools. Okay, you know, fantastic. All the way from elementary so you're to involved high in a lot. So yes. um, tell us uh, again. You also take care of our kids caster too. Oh, yeah. yeah. Each week here too. Um, Jessica, how can people get involved if they want more information about this uh, buyback program? They can go to our website www.springsdentistry.com, or okay. they can give us a call at our office at 719-599-5700. Okay. You know them, you love them right here. Best smiles in town. There you go. Show those pearly whites. Oh, yeah. Lydia and Daru. Thank you so much, guys. Thanks. Thank you. All right.